Hello, Steph, back with another video. Men must make good choices when dealing with women in relationships. And you know, this one's a no brainer. Um, shout out to Ron Wills on this one. I believe I made uh, maybe two videos about this like two years ago about choices um, men must make with women because, you know, there's guys out here, you know, oh man, this girl, she bad, she she fine. Oh man, she got a nice way, cute face, you know. Shoot, man, oh man, she she let me hit and all this other stuff. But um, you know, not really understanding who this woman is may cost you. You know what I'm saying? Especially too on your mental, you know, uh may cost you, especially in your pockets. And I usually see that a lot with guys who are married to these women for a long time. Not with the younger generation, I would say like the older ones, they just, they try to stick it out until that woman is just like sick and tired of them. And I say it like this all the time, usually those guys who, those older guys who are just like, they go to work, take care of the kids and just lay up with their wife, they usually wasn't that guy. They usually wasn't. And you see where it's miserable and they try to get you to be in that same situation that's why i always make these videos on you gotta make better choices with the women because um you know there's women out here who are making uh bad choices you know in their early age yeah we, we see this all the time even still you know they sleep with this dude or this dude and this dude and they know that is no good for, they know that that guy is no good for them but you know they you know they they have babies and he's only around to pay child support but then they expect you know this good guy who is there and i'm gonna say it like this too most women have that good guy at an early age but it's just they want to see where it goes with this other guy or like i like to say maybe the grass is greener on the other side but that's her thing. And we're not here to blame women for that, but that, you know, that's just the dynamic. And that's why a lot of men have a problem. Wait a minute, man, you, you choose this player, dude. You choose this toxic dude. Oh, and then now you want a nice guy. Yeah, those things happen. But like I say, you have to understand who that woman is. You have to understand, you gotta break it down like, you know, how she is. And she's not going to tell you the truth, but you have to like analyze and see what it is. All right. Like I was talking to a guy about that uh, a couple weeks ago. Shout out to my homie, man. Yeah. Um, you know, because he was telling me, oh, this thick girl like this. But, you know, when I'm the watcher, you know, if you know certain books and they talk about that. And when you're the watcher, you understand how she's behaving. You know, say, yeah, she lit, she looked thick you know, to a lot of guys, but her actions and her choices are everything. And that can affect you. Right. That's even with uh, single mothers, you know, like. Uh, I'm going to say like this, in my opinion, yeah, there, you know, there's a lot more single mothers out here. And, you know, guys be like, man, I don't give a damn. I'll, I'll smash one, especially guys who don't have no children. You know, they date these type of women and then, you know, they really don't know if that if that guy, if there's like still an attachment to that guy. You know, you doing all the good things, all the right things, all the all the things that, you know, a man is supposed to do. But she's still giving it up to giving up to her baby daddy who's just doing the bare minimum got to be careful with that. You know, there's, there's a lot of women doing that, you know, and there's some beautiful ones out there, you know, who do, but like I say, it's the choices, you know, and honestly too, those bad choices, especially too, when the woman does play with, play games on you, now you in a messed up space. Why? Because you wasn't thinking. It was like I said, the looks got to you. And that's why I say you have to be careful with that, you know, and it, I, I'm honestly, you know, there's, like I said, videos, there, there's, there's women out there who do like me, you know, who are single mothers. But as I was listening to the conversations and understanding her type of guys that she won, you, I said to myself, nah, I cannot deal with this.
Nah, I can't. You know, it's no disrespect to the woman. It's no no disrespect to them, you know, but long term wise, in your investment, you're in time, you gotta understand that's precious. That's why I say, you know, your freedom as a man is very important. You know, um a lot of guys don't really understand when you don't have no children and you have no you have no girl, man, you have all the time in the world to create or do something great with your life. You have a chance to see how it's like when, let's say financially wise, you can go to downtown and enjoy the, the nightlife a little bit. And, you know, you, you sitting comfortably in an apartment, you know, anything could happen. You got some money saved away. You can just handle that situation. And, you know, that's a good relief. A lot of men don't take into that because guys be like going on these frivolous dates with women that are no good for them. And they wonder why, you know, why am I still stuck? You know, why am I, you know, everything, even myself personally, um, I love the freedom of I can, I can, I can work out twice a day. Most men who, who got a girl or even most men who single fathers, man, you know, you got to work two jobs and take care of child support and all this. That's that's a lot on people that uh, that's a lot on the guy. That's because of choices they didn't make. Yeah, she cute. Yeah, she, you know, yeah, her, you know, she got that wagon poking out. Like, you know, like I see a lot of beautiful women on Twitter like that. But how is she overall? I'm just saying on the Internet, you know what I'm saying? But when you meet these women in person, how are they overall? And a lot of guys just ignore it. You know, there's some women out here who got some, you know, messed up uh, dudes. Like I've, I've talked to beautiful women who been abused by these guys you know what i'm saying but you're not understanding that you know she can she can be like that towards you you like i say you can be this good dude overall you can be this great guy but next thing you know it gets into argument she she want to throw hands at you just like her dude did shoot she want to take her or trauma out on you just like you this like um like the dude did and now you, you know, I was messing with your mental because you didn't make those conscious decisions. And I'm going to say it like this. A lot of people don't make don't have healthy relationships. Why? Because of bad choices. Bad choices cost you. You know what I'm saying? I, like I said, I've seen it happen a lot, man. I'm just like, yo, I, I remember talking to a, a good friend of mine before he got with a single woman, you know, a single mother. You know, he was. He already graduated from college with associate's degree. He could have went for his master's and put himself in a way better situation. But instead, he was chasing his woman because the kitty cat was good. You know what I'm saying? The, the kitty cat was amazing to him. And, you know, he got out of that. But it's like you got to deal with that woman for like, you know, the next 18 years. And, you know, you may be in a better relationship with somebody else, but. When you got to visit your kids, she's still going to be yakking at your mouth. And now you just be like, oh, man, here we go again. You know what I'm saying? Those are because of bad choices. And like I say, too, you know, there's men out here, like I said, who who are in these um, miserable relationships. They try to put you in that situation, especially, too, when you are young. You know, you you want to you want to be a conscience of what do you want to do with that? Even like, you know, you got a great idea. You want to write a book or something. Oh, man, you need to focus on this. You need to focus on that. You got to be smart enough and tell yourself, nah, now is not the time. Like I said, in the sacrifice video, you got to sacrifice sometimes to get a better life that you want. But choices with women, even choices with friends, man, um, might have to do a video on this. You know, uh, the people you hang around is a, a is a very important situation. Like I say in videos, guy at my job, man, talking bad about me and this, that third. I'm a walk away from it because it's not healthy. You know, I, I said on Twitter, Keefy D, man, he should have he should left uh, Diddy alone. He wouldn't be in this uh, Tupac mess. You know what I'm saying? But he kept playing around. Well, yeah, he kept playing with it. And now he 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 back to getting charged over 20 something years. Choices, choices that you got to make. And even myself, I still got to be careful. That's why my father always tell me, be careful. 
but you got to be smart with these choices. That's the end of the video. Goodbye.